What's going on guys? It's your boy Adjen back again for another other plane video. And for today, let us talk about tomorrow's update because the patch note has already been released. Let us talk about the good things and the bad things. So let us go ahead to the old stop page uh, with the patch note. So tomorrow we will be getting a new hero, Charlotte Drop Rate Up. This is the new 3 star character that will be added into the game. I made the separate video on should you summon for Charlotte. Uh, my honest thoughts about her and why she is good or not. So you might want to check that one out on, a, on my uh, separate video. I would gladly appreciate that one if you would like and subscribe also to the channel. So besides Charlotte, we will be getting a uh, returning banner for Mayne. So yeah, if you you miss out on Mayne, Mayne will be available tomorrow after the update. She's still pretty good, especially on normal arena. Maybe also a really good wildcard pick during the RTA. So if you still don't have Mayne, this is your chance to grab your Mayne. And then uh, we will be getting a new side story for Charlotte. So if you get Charlotte, you will be able to unlock Charlotte's uh, side story where you can par farmer shards. And then the biggest update for tomorrow is this one the new competitive content real-time arena beta so this is just going to be a beta test uh, I'm really excited for this one but my hype was uh, it goes down the drain why it because they put some uh, specific time for this real-time arena so it only available for uh, this one uh, 9 to I think this one is 9 a.m. to 1 a 1 p.m. KST time and then uh, 8 p.m. up to 12 a.m. KST time now this timing are really really bad for me why because this first timing uh, I'm pretty much uh, drooling on my bed this is the only time that I can sleep before I go to work so yeah, this one is a, a big, big no for me. And this one is when I am at work. Uh, afternoon in my work. So yes, there, these timings killed the hype for me for RTA because I cannot play RTA during this time. Why they did put some specific times for RTA? Why they did not just allow this one to go on, to go open for the whole day during the duration of the beta test in epic 7 there are no specific time for rta why why ba games why why are you doing this i'm really hyped for rta but you do this to me i'm really disappointed uh, my hype is already gone uh, for rta with this one i hope that uh, they will change this one or maybe they will open uh, more time for rta i cannot i already prepared my characters for rta with my with my video yesterday right ah damn it this is disappointing so the rta is pretty much the same like i've explained in my uh how it works video how rta works video pretty much the same in epic 7 so in rta you can find different people from different servers it is it is a cross server uh pvp competition which is good so no matter what server you are playing, you can match up with other players on different servers. Also, there are uh, what do you call this a uh, friendly matchup, but the friendly matchup can only be from your own server. You cannot have a friendly matchup with other characters from different servers. So take note on that one. So this one pretty much the same matchmaking in prog progress, looking for an opponent. So when you find an opponent, uh, you can enter the pre ban. I've already explained this one on my uh, video before, the showcasing the how RTA works. They are pretty much the same. Pre-ban, selection phase, and then uh, banning on the ban, ban again, banning the hero on the selection phase, and then the battle. You can only choose use uh, four characters on the battle. So yes, this one should be really good. But as I've said, I'm a bit disappointed since it has time, time frame to play RTA. 
Damn it. I cannot play RTA. Like what? So these are the rankings. Pretty much the same like in a normal arena. Bronze, Silver, Gold, Platinum, Diamond, Master, Top 100 up to Top 1. For now, we are still on the go going to be on the pre-seasons because this one is going just to be a beta testing. Uh, it's still not yet the final league or final season. But I hope that when they open the new season for RTA, it's going to be uh, no time restriction or no time schedule so that everyone uh, can play RTA during their free time. No matter the time zone where they are, I hope they change that one. It's really disappointing. I've already sent a feedback on the official Outer Plane Discord regarding to this one. And I know there are people also who are not in uh, favorable with the RTA timings. Uh, there will be rewards, but they did not specify the rewards for the... Maybe they will uh, tackle this one during the start of the season because we are going to be entering the beta test and pre-season so there will be no rewards so yeah kind of disappointing right this is the biggest update one of the biggest uh, update that i'm currently uh, looking forward to in outer, outer plane but mm, meh they killed it they killed it with the time restriction man then we will be getting a new battle pass for charlotte i'm not really I like the design of the because uh, upper legs exposure, but I'm not gonna be buying this one. And aside from that one, just some regular packs, new packs, ending, and then uh, some some improvements that I don't really care about. Uh, friends are going to be uh, added. Uh, friend expansion to be are going to be uh, from 30 to 50 now. It does not really matter to me. I don't care about this one. The weekly mission dismantle gear, I don't really pay attention to this one. It's really easy to get the weekly mission uh, done just by doing your dailies. I don't know why are these uh, minor things are being uh, chain changed and uh, they're fixing this one. Uh, also, what one of my uh, concerns is that uh, why don't they increase the, the equipment uh, capacity? 600 uh, is not it's very small yes the, I, I want it to be uh probably 2000 uh, equipment uh, slot should be uh the bare minimum in my answer especially there are a lot of uh, really good gears that have some potential that cannot be upgraded because of the lack of gold so you're saving them but if you don't have the equipment uh, slot limit the slot for that one uh, some of them are just going to get sold. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, the inventory, you cannot go past the 600. As you can see, I am 594 over 600. Every day, I'm trying to sell some gears. I hope that they increase this one to be uh, 2,000. I think 2,000 is uh, a really good uh, amount of uh, gear slot. So yeah, and then some error fixes here which I don't really care about. New character, new game mode which is RTA and then some minor bug fixes or some minor changes. Uh, this patch is going to be really good for those people who can play RTA during uh, the time it will be open. But for me, which uh, I'm not available during those times, it's kind of meh. It's a bit disappointing. So what do you guys think about this patch update? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I think that's it for me for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you can help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time. Peace.